Hey guys, Fazello here. So this is definitely going to be more of a shorter video just because this discussion is definitely not that, I guess, detailed because I just only really have one point that I want to make. But I feel like I should mention this because there's a pretty popular article going around from dailystar.co.uk saying that a possible release date for Metroid Prime 4 on Switch has been leaked or revealed. And I just wanted to spend some time explaining why I'm 90% positive that this is not the actual release date for Metroid Prime 4. Of course though, if you do want to look more into this article, feel free to. I'll have a link to the article in the description. And I absolutely implore you to look more into this because there's a lot of points that they make. But without further ado, let's get into this. So basically just to break down what Daily Star has to say, a CZEC retailer has a page for Metro Prime 4 saying that the game will release on November 29th, 2019. And that's a pretty, that's not like something that just says like 2019 or like just some whatever date. Like that's a pretty specific date and Daily Star does acknowledge that, which that's definitely something that's not that common. You may see him like, as they say, a quarter or just a year. But the 29th of November, that's very specific. That's an exact date. And as they do go on to say, it does make sense for the game to release in November or December. I would probably predict the game to launch in December just because that's where the holiday season really hits home. But really just November, December, January, that sort of holiday time is really when you want to schedule games to come out because that's when of course Christmas comes out and you want to have as many people getting your games as possible. So I'm not going to doubt at all that Nintendo is going to release Metroid Prime 4 in one of like the holiday season and I'm somewhat confident that's going to come out in 2019. However, I do not think that November 29th, 2019 is the date. Now Daily Star did say that this could be a placeholder and although it is very specific and you could usually just see placeholders for a quarter or a year. I have seen placeholders for game dates that have been not actually true. So for example, I actually received backfire for a video I made over a year ago talking about the essentially same topic where Amazon had a listing for Metroid Prime 4 saying that the game would re release on like December 29th or December 26th of 2019 and I thought that this could be an accidental leak of the release date of Metroid Prime 4 but there's two things that you have to keep in mind first off Nintendo probably at this point considering how big Metroid Prime 4 probably is they probably don't even have a proper release date to be that specific for the game they might be coming up with ideas but I don't think it would be that far out plus why would they give it to a CZEC retailer and not like a more popular or just more well-known retailer I I'm not saying that there's an issue with that because they could very well have given it to a CZEC retailer, but I feel like of all people they'd give it to first, it would probably be like Walmart or like Amazon or something like that. Now I could be absolutely wrong and being honest, I kind of hope I am because knowing the release date for Metroid Prime 4 in advance E3 would be kind of nice, although I do like the surprises of E3. It's just, it's kind of exciting to know when you're going to be able to play the newest Metroid. However, I just don't think that November 29th, 2019 is the actual release date for this game. However, that is my opinion, and if you have your own opinion, make sure to leave it in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video, and as always, see you.